The one thing that we really had to learn about in going into this was that sound really matters because I come from the world of still photos and you know it's all about that image and when you first get into video you're kind of thinking well it's all about that image and really you know that's a portion of it probably not the biggest part of it it's the sound people want to hear what people are saying and when you have a program where people struggle to hear what is being said then they're going to tune out The first thing we got was a Wirecast program to use on our laptop, which makes it a lot easier. And, you know, doing things like overlays, insetting a video that we have as a pre-roll or something to show inside the program, which involves three cameras and, you know, live audio and, and, and a stream on Facebook. We try to do some on scene of some events. Mainly it would be something like a news conference or something like that if it's big enough. And we've done things like a show called Beer Hour where we have one of the reporters, Katie Bergen, has talked with um, some of our local celebrities of sorts. Shows with our sports writers like uh, the Kansas City Chiefs. Some of these shows they've actually sold sponsorships to so we put a little logo in there and um, there's all sorts of rules about what you can do on Facebook with sponsorships but we, we follow those, learned about those. So just a whole variety of shows. It's, it's been fun and you know there's no commercials. It's, it just runs and runs sometimes and as long as you know you have something interesting going on people sit and watch. Today we are doing a Facebook Live program. It's a partnership of a town hall that we've been doing. This one is with American Public Square. There's a lot that can be said for planning ahead, I'm scouting out your locations, knowing what you're getting into as far as what your signal's going to be like, if you have any control over that. If you can, hardwire in to Ethernet if possible. We've begged, borrowed, and stole for you know, data to, to do our shows. Just those kind of details have uh, huge effects on how successful your show is going to be. American Public Square and tonight's guest, Governor DeFault, Patrick. It's just incredible technology that, you know, to think that you had to have a multi-million dollar television studio not all that long ago to do that kind of work is amazing. It's getting to try new things. It's, it's a, a bit of a new frontier. You know, it's, it's one of those things where you can fail at it because it is new. Whenever you can take somebody and show somebody someplace they may not get to go on their own and bring that to life, it, it really can engage people.